And we're back, this time with Vice President of Latin America, Gustavo Mbusali. Thank you so much for being Thank here. Thank you, Fritz. How's we were going for you? Well, it, Sweet World is that kind of time that we wait the whole year to be here, those three days. And we come a lot of, with a lot of energy, a lot of partners, a lot of customers coming, hearing a lot of uh, new things, new stuff that can make the life of our customers better. So it's it's been amazing so far. And remind our audience, Gustavo, where did you travel from? I traveled from Sao Paulo. I'm based in Sao Paulo, Brazil. So oh I traveled gosh. all the way over. So and cool. We have people from all around Latin America here, from Chile, from Argentina, from Colombia, from Mexico, from Brazil. Wow. So there's a lots and lots of diversity here, diverse people yeah. from diverse countries. Very cool. Yeah, I got you. you just made my my list of next travel locations. <laughs> well, and I, I didn't talk about Caribbean, Dominican Republic. Oh, wow. you know, oh, yeah. so we can expand that. Yeah, over. I like it. I like it. Yeah, beautiful places from mountains to beaches. Exactly. So we love it. We so, love it. Well, with all these folks in Latin America also uh, tuning in right now, why don't we dive into what's on the top of mind for businesses there today? Yeah, I was just recapping for everyone that is watching us today. Is we started with Mexico, so Mexico was the first country that we put our step in and launched Sweet Success and launched, launched the editions of Sweet Success. So Mexico had been a very successful successful country for us. Then we stepped in into Colombia where you remember we launched Sweet Success as well. We we're doing really well. Lots and lots of customers. We have a customer here that have a very interesting story that I can tell you in a while. And also uh, Brazil is the th third country that we launched at Sweet Success. But not only that, we have uh, many other countries that do not have Sweet Success that are still uh, adopting our platform. So those are overall remembering that, the big pictures, the three countries that we launched at Sweet Success and br are bringing more and more product, right? Today we just announced it. Uh, sweet Success Manufacturing for Brazil, so more editions, wow. more product, NSAW being available in Brazil is a huge asset. All our customers, all our audience that is hearing us today would benefit from that as well. So, you know, uh, lot, lots of big things for our customers going really, really well. You've been busy. Yeah. Very busy. <laughs> That's a good thing. More, more than busy looking for what we can take right away from here, from what we are hearing and applying into the regions. Awesome. Our customers get really excited about our announcement, so we're texting all day long besides <laughs> all the meetings. Answer, hey, when I, I would have that available in my region or can I use that right now? So customers are really excited and partners are really excited as well. Awesome. Well, lots of growth that's happened for NetSuite in the region and lots of growth, growth to come. But let's talk about our customers. How are you seeing our customers in the region change and grow right now, maybe in some new ways? Yeah. So we're getting custom, the, the very different uh, story right now. We're getting very different customers like startup business mm -hmm. on businesses that we never thought before. So I'll give you a quick example. We did last year, uh, just recapping as well, we did a Sweet Connect in Brazil, in Sao Paulo. It was our first Sweet Connect of ever. Evan was there as well. It was a great launch. Uh, lots of people, lots of entertainment. And we got a, custom, a couple of customers that uh, during the meeting, they, they acquired NetSuite and they implemented NetSuite. So I have one good story, wow. which is a company named Vivaz Energia, mm -hmm. Energy. So they're an energy company, and what they do is... They're a B2C company. So imagine yourself, you are at your home, you receive your bill for your electricity, for the utilities you, you purchase. What they do is you upload your bill into their website or into their app, and they give you 20% back discount on, on your bill. Wow. And Wait, I will explain. How can I get that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I will explain to you how they're doing that. So what, what they have been doing is they have put solar uh, solar panels and solar uh, industry generators yeah. outside the cities generate the energy based on solar which is basically free you just need to buy the infrastructure and they made an agreement to put that back into the grid so that gets into the grid so they sell that energy to the operator of the grid for a certain price and when they get your bill they do a match between what they put in the grid for their price 
and what you pay, they get a, a spread on it and, and make your life easier. So they're transforming the life of, 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 of consumers, electricity consumers, in a way that we never thought before. And NetSuite was the technology that made that possible and available for them because they need to be live in three months. So this was a startup business. They got funded, all the good stuff of being a startup, but they need to deliver very fast and the results very fast. So we allowed them to build hundreds of thousands of invoices uh, within NetSuite and, you know, the bottom line, ending the bills to the consumers and transforming the lives. Wow. Oh, That's a great story. It's it, a very good story. It, it is. It truly, truly tremendous. Um, and it's on our website as well as a case study. So anyone that wants to see more details can check in on NetSuite.com. It's published in there. And, and a video to go along with it. That's right. Yeah. So make sure you check that out. Um, so how is NetSuite addressing the changing needs of the businesses in the region right now? Uh, the, the, the region is changing very fast in terms of uh, laws. We see right now from, from Sweet World this year, I could see that all the world is going to electronic invoicing, something that we have done already mm -hmm. 10 years ago right. in the region. So the region was one of the first adopters. So we're in the next stages out of that. So we're uh, th there's a legal changes going on, but as well as any other region looking for AI. So AI is the, is the word right now, everybody looking for efficiency, but most of the companies, the growing companies that it's our market, uh, they, they need to realize or they're realizing that they need data right. for AI to be productive for them. Otherwise, if you do not have data, if you do not know your numbers, AI will not work for you. Right, so, and what we're doing is taking NetSuite to them to do this first part to establish their foundation so they could go to the next level. And by all the announcements that we're receiving and hearing here, having that embedded already bring to any company the power of get, having their data and at the same time uh, taking the, the, the approach of AI as well. Uh, on stage today, Craig announced, I think it was sweet success for manufacturing. That's in great. Brazil? Yeah. In Brazil? Yeah. How is that, go how, how that going to go over? That's going to affect a lot our market because when we talk about Brazil specifically, there are two big industries. The largest industry is manufacturing in Brazil. So the number of companies that we have in manufacturing is much more than any other industry. And the second one are services company, which we already use it to serve. So this is a game changer for, for NetSuite and, and for the country, for the companies that are looking uh, for a new solution. And by having sweet success on manufacturing is a game changer because they're used to implement ERPs the traditional way on, the, on any vendor goes there and say, what do you want? And we come with the sweet success approaches. Those are the leading practices. This is what we do. This is how all the other 37,000 companies have been doing worldwide. And this is what you should adopt to be very successful on a short uh, term. Okay, so we've talked about, like you said, the growth that we've had in the region recently. Where are we headed in the future? We, you know, we, you have, there's still so many countries to reach, so many businesses to reach. How do we continue to expand globally in LID? Yeah, that's a great question. So what, what we're going to do is we'll double down on any country that we are right now. Okay. So that's the next step is doubling down everything that we have because like Brazil has 26 states. We're just present with people in eight. Yeah. So what we're going to do is we're going to expand to all the states. Mexico, we already populated the states. Right. Colombia, we have already people in all the states. So next thing is keep expanding Brazil. And we are actually looking already into new countries uh, to get in. So we're on that point that we're researching on it, discussing with product. But our audience, our customers, our prospects uh, will near, uh, we'll hear very shortly that we'll be expanding to other countries as well. 
really, really exciting stuff. I cannot believe it, but our time here is almost up. If there's one message that you hope our LAD audience who are tuning in right now and who, who are here with us at Sweet World today, if there's one message you hope they take away from Sweet World 2023, what is it? Yeah, there is no other company that have this, the offering that we have globally and for LAD as well, which is the Sweet. So we were talking a lot about the sweetness, single source of truth. Any company can take your decisions from them. And by now embedding AI, there's no other company that can do what we do. And this will benefit all our customers and clients. Wow, you heard it here first. That's right. <laughs> Luchas gracias. I had to add one more word to what Craig said on stage. He just said gracias. Oh, yeah, you're so, right. You know. There you go. Gracias and obrigado. There we, you go. We're, there we're Portuguese go. Yeah. and Spanish, we so go. now we're full. There you Thank go. you. I Thank you it. for the time. Thank you, Gustavo.